To be eligible for Medi-Cal, an individual needs to meet the resource requirements that are imposed by Medi-Cal. For an unmarried person, the individual could have a car of any value, a home of any value, retirement accounts such as IRAs and 401ks of any value, certain annuities, as well as $2,000 in cash reserves. The same rules apply for a married applicant, except that the well spouse, the one who's not going into the long-term care facility, may retain up to $115,000 in cash reserves. The problem is that most clients have more than $2,000, or in the case of a married applicant, more than $115,000 in cash reserves. So how do you qualify? With proper planning and the guidance of an elder law or experienced estate planning attorney, you can get qualified for Medi-Cal even if you have substantial cash assets. The method is by gifting the assets away or spending the assets down so that you come within the thresholds for Medi-Cal. Don't try to do this on your own because in some cases it's irreversible and if you don't do it properly you might find yourself worse off than you were before. But with proper planning you can gift your assets away and get approved for Medi-Cal in a very short period of time. Call our office if you have any questions, we'd be glad to help you.